Hi, what is the value of d given that you have take it to the power of d times take it to the power of d times take it to the power of d equals 72? Then let's have it to be solution. Then let us recall when we have a to the power of m times a to the power of m times a to the power of m. This equals as when we have a to the power of m in parentheses to the power of 3. So likewise happened to this, we have it to be 3 to the power of d in parentheses to the power of 3 equals 72. So from here, when we have a to the power of m in parentheses to the power of n equals as a to the power of m times n, so this will be 3 to the power of 3d equals 72. Then from here, let's introduce log to both sides. So here we take to log 3 to the power of 3d equals log 72. Then when we have log p to the power of m equals m multiplied by log p. So we have here to be tiggy d multiplied by log 3 equals log 72. So let's define true by log 3. So from here, this we cancel out this. So we are going to have 3d equals log 72 over log 3. So when we have log 3 will be equals we have log 3 times 24 over log 3. Then log 3 we have this as log 3 plus log 24 over log 3. So when we have log a times b in parentheses equals as log a plus log b, and that's why we have this. So 3d equals, we can divide through by 3 over log 3 plus log 24 over log 3. So from here, we have 3d. This, we cancel out this, we have 1 plus this, we have log 24, we can also have to be 3 times 18, 3 times 8 over log 3. So we have this to be 3d, 1 plus log 3 plus log 8. So we can divide through by log 3 from here. So we have 3d, 1 plus this, we count out this, we have 1 plus log 8 over log 3. So we have 3d, 1 plus 1 will be 2 plus log we have 8 log 8 over log 3 then when we have log a over log b equals as log a in base b 
So we have log A over log B and equals log A in base B. So therefore from here, so we have 3D equals to plus log 8 in base 3. So dividing through by 3, this we cancel out this. So we have D. 2 plus log 8 in base 3 over 3 and this is the value of t then let us now verify this answer that we got let's say to check we have to recall that we have Take it to the power of d times take it to the power of d times take it to the power of d and this equals 72. We simplify this to be take it to the power of d plus d plus d which equals 72. So simplify this for that we have here to be take it to the power of 3d equals 72. Then when we substitute the value of d that we have here to be this so we are going to have 3 to the power of 3 open parenthesis 2 plus log 8 in base 3 over 3 then it's going to give us 72 so this guy here we cancel out this guy we have 3 to the power of 2 plus log 8 in base 3 then it's going to give us 72 when we have a to the power of n plus n this is cause as a to the power of n times a to the power of n so we have here to take it to the power of 2 times take it to the power of log 8 in base 3 then it's going to give us 72 when we have t to the power of 2, simply means t times t, and this will give us 9 times t to the power of log 8 in base t, then it's going to give us 72. Recall, when we have a to the power of log b in base a, this always equals b. So far, this base and this are the same, so the output will be equals B. So we have 9 times this and this are the same. The output will be 8, which will cost 72. So 9 times 8 is 72, it cost 72. So since the left hand side equals to the right hand side, this implies D equals 2 plus log 8 in base 3 over 2 satisfied so if you are new here and you find this video interesting don't forget to share like comment and subscribe to our youtube channel for more master tutorial videos